going to be winning the most. But think about that. Think about this game's since this game's uh, inception. Four times right now in this season, he's been able to defeat zero. That's a really big deal when you put it into perspective, especially when you consider this guy's results and just how dominant he's been. All right. So with well, all that said, yep. we shall see if Larry can once again get it done or will zero reign supreme and book himself a trip into this winner's finals. Uh, his opponent, of course, uh, will be decided uh, later on. Yep, and you already saw Zero try to see if he can set up to force Larry to recover below when he opted for that down tilt after that pressure on the right side of the stage. But here it is. Larry trying to return the favor, but okay, here's an opportunity for him to push Zero again to the right side of the stage. Is he going to keep him there? Mm. Looking to do that right there. Big time trade. Oh, and there comes Zero quickly with those monkey kicks. Yeah, man, the back and forth. These guys, when it comes to like pressure, they know how to exert it, and it's just really fun seeing how they both like switch places when it comes to who's in the lead at, when, or who's it, it at the advantage when it comes to stage positioning. I hear you there. Uh huh. And there it is. That that forward air actually stood out a bit longer than I expected, catching Larry off guard too as he got pushed back. Yeah. So pretty good start here for Zero. Uh, definitely in control for the most part. Oh, oh, very late on that punish by Larry. Yeah, seriously, Larry. because I, I like the idea behind it, but the timing was not there at all. Okay, opportunity. Don't give zero second chances here. You will live to regret them, or you might not live in certain cases, as we saw right there. All right, maybe trying to catch a roll right there. Zero not giving it to him. And I love the spacing on that neutral air. Was able to sneak in that forward tilt, but this is going to get punished unless. <laughs> <laughs> he just opted to just go high above it. And th to be honest, that's a better punish for uh, Larry to deal with than, like, him probably getting thrown off stage by zero. Right, via a grab, something like that. Yeah. Lesser of two evils, I agree with you on that one. Oh. But nonetheless, zero is in the lead here, and what a lead it is starting to become here. They're getting a little overwhelmed here. Even on his home turf here. Lila, oh my goodness. Very good opportunity for zero to finish off this edge guard. Let's see. Firefox, no two frame here. Out on this day. Larry with another chance right now. 95% though. Just clearing this first stock off of zero has just been such a tall task for him thus far. Oh, oh man, but a oh. little betrayal on the part of his nanner <laughs> will yield him that stock. I don't think he saw that one coming. Uh-oh. Smart moves right there by Larry Lur. And zero with a good DI to get out of there with that fair to break it up. Oh my yes. gosh. Oh, this is where you don't want to get caught there, Zero. Struggling to get back to the stage, but he makes it back. All right. Wow. Wish the down smash right there. Larry with these second chance opportunities. Okay, and if you see Larry go for a fair, Zero could go for a fair. Uh, I mean, a uh, side B, Zero could fair him as well, but we didn't see that there. Oh, that was really good. Put a little bit of pressure there with the back here. You know you're descending. It's going to give Larry the confidence that he can just come from that shield. Come down, try and get a position to punish, and then the up tilt just waiting. One of Diddy's hit and kill moves right there, I feel like. Yeah, that was tough. So many times you just kind of forget that's an option, especially at the yep. higher percents. But you know who didn't forget? Zero. Definitely smart move right there. Uh, zero always catching these players off guard when he applies pressure at the edge. <clears throat> All right, so here we are off to town and city for game number two. Let's see if Larry can change his luck a bit and get on the board here. Poor Zero looking to go up 2-0. All right, so already creating a little bit of space, but Larry immediately take control of that Nanner. All right, just backs off a little bit here. Respect that. Finds an opening right there. And trying to press this little bit of an advantage, but here comes Zero off a of pivot grab. Oh, oh wow, not getting the, uh, looking for the double back air, I would imagine, but not to be. Yeah, you just saw Falling Fair actually pulling Zero to the ground. And right now, Zero just making sure that Larry's not able to finish these follow-ups every time he's getting caught in the air, which allows Zero to get an opportunity to mount a comeback, even if he's behind. Wow, double monkey flip right there. Oh, yep. putting Zero in a very favorable position right here. Great Jeez. clap, clap. And there's the dap to finish it off. Man, you are out of here, Zero. Already off to another strong start. And, man, I tell you, as What's monkey up? flips, man, he gets away with so many monkey flips. Yeah, and, and I've heard <laughs> players so, so many times, man. If you can beat the monkey flip, you can beat zero, man. But it's so much easier said than done, though we do see a good interception on the part of Larry right there with the up air. Let's see how far he can gain off of this. The back air, and that's going to be the stock. 
So if you notice what Larry did there, he kind of ran up to Zero, saw him. Uh, he he kind of like straw hopped in his face. Zero went for a straw hop too, so it worked out in his favor. If Zero probably stayed grounded and shielded, he probably would have been in a good position. But smart scouting but right there by Larry. Oh, falling up here, that kind of reminded me of old school Diddy. Frame that it did get changed on the up air. But still, Zero using it to break combos when he has the chance. Oh, this is wild. Yeah. That was a scary Firefox, but I do feel like that back here, though, probably the lesser of a couple evils that could have came of that. Had Zero really going hard to get a punish there, but nonetheless, still find himself doing quite well. <laughs> All right, Opportunity on. for the upper, but kind of a miss. Oh, was holding on to that banana, but Larry unable to hold on to that stock. Zero up 2 0 right now. What yeah. do you think of D1? What, uh, do you think a character change could be in line? I so mean, um,. As far as, like, stages are concerned, I was thinking we might see a triplat at some point. But, uh... Perhaps now's the time to call upon that. Yeah, I mean, we have a uh, battle. Well, uh, then again, if uh, Zero Banda, the triplatform layout, that might be a little bit rough for him. All right, here we go. All right, let us begin back to Smash where we go. Larry, obviously not content with how that last match went down. Oh, but I think Zero's looking for the mean repeat. Oh, there, there, there's the monkey flip again. Okay. That's a grab right there. I was just trying to see if he can get an opportunity to start linking together these up airs, but it's been a little bit difficult. It has. Yeah. Zero has been doing a good job of escaping juggle situations. Probably will take a little bit of damage, but no strong finishes right there. All right. Okay. Nice. Able to spot dodge. Incoming monkey flip. Though... Despite his best efforts, oh my goodness, Zero just unrelenting right there, sitting at that clean dollar menu percent at seven. Oh my god. And here it is. I'm going to tell you right now. Larry Lurge going for these like center stage side Bs just to get control again. Like, I, I know you can condition your opponent by doing that, yeah. by going for that a lot, but right now Zero is kind of on top of it and taking the stocks when it matters. So. This is looking very scary for Larry Lur. And there it is again. He puts himself in a position where he can punish those side Bs. Uh, it's interesting how he didn't get that last one, but mo for the most part, he's been punishing a lot of them. Uh-oh. You think it might be too little too late here for Larry Lur? Uh, you know, I've seen Zero seemingly with a, a couple of flubs on his part. Oh, he is so lucky he had his jump right there because yeah. I smelled that they are coming had that not been the case. Zero's just been beating him in the neutral so many times. Obviously, you're seeing that being the huge difference maker. And Zero on the verge of just lapping this man right here. And I love the fact <laughs> that he's just he's playing right behind the banana too in that situation. And overcut into anything. Larry gonna go for this up air? Yes. Oh, and he kind of delayed. It. He saw him delay the attempt too because he knew Zero was too high, but still couldn't find it. Uh-oh, bad spot. Okay, cool. Zero couldn't get the fair. Yeah, the fair just coming out a little too early right there, but you got to say that down tilt, up smash right on time, and the 3-0 handedly delivered right there on the part of TSM Zero. Good effort from Larry, but it was not meant to be on this day. Oh, yeah, man. Impressive plays from Zero all around. You saw a lot of great punishes, especially when it came to Larry Lur's recovery. Larry basically kind of got caught every time he wanted to opt for those like center stage recoveries, man. Uh, you even saw it too with the Firefox. I don't know what happened. Maybe the fact—I guess it's the fact that Zero's ledge trapping can be so scary that he wants to like just desperately, you know, Im like find sanctuary. Right? right. It's like, man, this and you can't say it any better than that. It, it is just terrifying because when you really think about it, you spend all that time trying to get back to the ledge, and, and before you know, it, you're taking you know anywhere between 50 and 70 percent. And you know, as we've seen right there, when Zero gets huge leads like that, he is not prone to dropping them, uh, and it certainly was not the case in all three of those games. So. Uh, Coach Pierce walking past me looking pretty satisfied with what he just saw right there, I'm sure. Uh, his boy is in winner's finals to go up against one of these next men coming.